Halo. There was a trailer for the Paramount Halo series. I'm pretty sure you saw it. Of course I saw it. I'd like I I said that's like oh my god ah, whoo, my, there's so much I have to say about that trailer. There's a lot to say. Um, it premieres March 24th on Paramount Plus. Um, so yeah, they're gonna give me a reason to get Paramount Plus. I'm I'm considering whether I should wait for the whole season, or maybe they'll post the season. I don't know how they do their stuff, but um, and then and then pay for it because I don't want to have to pay for several months worth of Paramount Plus, something that I'm barely gonna use just to watch Halo. But also don't want to get spoiled, so it's 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 a tough call. Uh, I might just have to spend that money. Um, and uh, you know, let's get into it. So I don't know. My notes immediately start with Cortana, but I kind of don't want to start with Cortana. But we're going to start with Cortana. Um, so <laughs> so um, they bring back Cortana's voice actress, but not Master Chiefs. And I have a feeling he's definitely going to show his face. But I still think he's going to be in his helmet for most of the time, like kind of like Mandalorian. He shows his face occasionally, but most of the time he's going to be have his helmet on. And if that is the case, why didn't he bring back Downs, who voices Master Chief? Like the, the dudes that they have is good. He's not bad. I think he's going to do a good job and he sounds good. But I kind of wish they stuck with Downs. And I, I don't understand why they bring back Cortana's voice, but not Downs. It, it just doesn't, it doesn't make sense to me. Um, but more on the katana, a lot of people don't like the way she looks. So her face is meant, she doesn't look like how she does in the game, obviously. She's meant to look like the actual actress who's voices katana in the games, and she also voices her in the show. My only problem with the way she looks is that she's not blue enough. And I know that's a weird thing people say. A lot of people are like, why are you nitpicking? But it's like, she's blue. <laughs> I want her to be completely blue and a, a little translucent. That's my only problem. I don't have a problem with the way that she looks. Because when you adapt something to live action, it's obviously going to look a little different, especially when you literally change the face model <laughs> to a, like a different person. So that doesn't bother me. And I kind of get bugged to hear people making fun of the way she looks because I'm like, bro, that's just what this woman looks like. Stop making fun of her. <laughs> that's just what she looks like. I get she doesn't look like what you remember, but that's because they're giving the actual actress who plays Katana a chance to actually physically be Katana. But yeah, go ahead. Uh, yeah, no, I also do not like the fact that she's not blue. It just seems a little weird to me. It seems like a very weird design choice that I don't really understand why they went with it. it yeah, makes... I feel like with all this backlash, this isn't as big of a fix, I feel like, like Sonic is. So maybe they could go and go back in and make her more blue before they release it. Or maybe she will be more blue and this just isn't either the CG's eye isn't finished or this it wasn't like the best scene to represent what she'll be looking like for the entirety of the show. Maybe Cortana evolves. I, 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 I don't know. Maybe she's a Pokemon. I don't, I, I really don't know. But um, the action looks great. I'm, I'm excited about the action. Um, I did hear that this is non-canon and this isn't adapting the games and it's not canon to the game. Yeah, they call it the silver timeline. Yeah, I don't really know what that means. I haven't played Halo Infinite, but to my knowledge, there's not exactly like multiple yeah. timelines in Halo. Not, so I don't really this is just that's just them saying like this is separate from <laughs> the original, um, which I think is a good way to go about it. Like that way you can retell the story for people who I haven't played the first three Halo games in a long time, so I don't remember much of it. Um, and there are obviously people who haven't played the games at all but are interested in the show. So I do prefer that they tell the story and like from the beginning. Oh yeah, no, I'm totally fine with them doing it. It's just a little weird to me that they were like, this is a different timeline. I'm like, well, what? wait a second, did I miss something? No, yeah, but, that, was, um, that was a very specific way to put it that I felt like was unnecessary, but maybe there will be time travel and we just don't know, or like um, multi-dimensional stuff. <laughs> What, what is it that uh, The Rock says about DC? The face of the Halo universe is about to change. <laughs> like, this is, this is going to be a weird oh, thing. Of the, DC, of the Halo universe. <laughs> I'm, but I'm, I'm very excited for it. Um, it's funny to me because I followed the guy who plays Master Chief, like the guy in the suit. I don't know if he's also the guy doing the voice, but the guy in the suit. Um, I follow him on Instagram. He's been getting ripped for this role, and I think it's just hilarious. He's been getting ripped for a role, and I don't think he's gonna have very many scenes outside the suit. <laughs> that's the thing, though. I think that he will. He'll have more scenes outside the suit than we think he does, and that's why they don't have Downs voicing him. Um, 
like they showed the scene where they had like showed his back and like the scars for where they like did augmentation. Like I think we might see more scenes like that than we think we are. And that is totally fair. I didn't really think about it as like as much outside of like in the books, in the games, in the comics. He's like rarely out seen outside of that suit. So I don't know. It was just a little weird for me because I'm like, I don't. I don't like. Hey, if you wanna you wanna get ripped, get ripped. I'm not. I'm not complaining. It's just kind of kind of funny how this man's going through like full like regimen superhero diet and exercise. Like he's gonna be four. Those elites look good. Um, those elites look real good. Uh, what is it? Something that <laughs> threw me off is that I never thought about this, but someone pointed out that grunts are like five four, and they look small because they're standing next to next to over a seven foot tall Spartan Master Chief. But they're really like the average height for a woman, which is five four, and that's kind of scary because <laughs> I always thought grunts were so small, and now I'm like, oh no, they're like regular people size. That's horrifying. <laughs> Imagine seeing a grunt in real life. That would be scary. <laughs> I know I'm just really tall, but that's still kind of short to me. <laughs> also, it's also a short in comparison to me, but that's also much bigger than they were in my mind. <laughs> yeah, no, that's, that's fair. It's just, that's kind of funny. Now they're, they're also like, like wide. They're also really wide too. So they're going to look huge if we were to like see them in person <laughs> they would be gigantic i'm like, just thinking about all the five four people i know because i know a lot of people that are like five four and um, yeah that's the like advertise for women <laughs> not just that like i have a lot of male friends that are also like five four and i call them short all the time because they kind of are if you're five four and you're listening i would say five five nine is advertise for a man so yeah five four is definitely short <laughs> for like i'm sorry you're, you're short that's not it's not that's not a problem like short people are cool yeah, no, but... it's, it's all right you can be short you know do your thing yeah, but just know that you're the average height of a grunt, and I think that's kind of hilarious. <laughs> just know you're the height of a grunt. <laughs> that's hilarious. 